would a little financial help help you out? Would a little financial help help you out to make your life a little easier? How you doing today? My name is Kayan Church. If you don't know me, uh, meet the new boss of in-home health care. Listen, what I do is I help financially challenge family members to become paid caregivers through the Medicaid long-term health care program. Now listen, if you're here with me live, give me a hashtag live. If you're here in the rebroadcast, hashtag rebroadcast. You know, let everybody know, like, you know, I'm here and uh, that good financial stability is what I'm looking for, you know? So how you doing today? You know what I mean? I got a lot of people question me and they say, KC, what can I do? Uh, a lady just, I just got off the phone with a lady. She told me that she takes care of her husband. Her husband is coming home from the hospital. He's in Medicaid. She says, Casey, I can't do it by myself no longer. What can you do? Can you hire somebody to come in? You know, what are my options? And I said, well, listen, you are already home. You're already doing the best that you can with him. Let me help put the paycheck in your pocket. You know what I mean? So what did I do? I turned around today and I signed her up. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna hire her to be the aide for her husband, you know? Now, I think that's an awesome thing because, you know, to be able to bring some money into the household, you know what I mean, is very important, very important. You know, you know, my kids need money to live, you know, they wanna eat, you know what I mean? My pop, he wanna go out and uh, do things. He wanna get a hoagie every now and then, you know what I'm saying? But if you don't have the financial stability, I don't know how you gonna pull that off, you know what I mean? How you doing today? Uh, you know, hashtag live, hashtag rebroadcast. Let everybody know, you know, that you're watching this. Michelle, how you doing? My people's from the city. What's going on with you? Listen, being a caregiver is like the most important role ever. See, a lot of people forgot how important the caregiver is, you know? See, a lot of people, every day they get up and they go out and they go to work and they handle their own business. You know what I mean? Which is awesome. That's great because that's what you're supposed to do in life. But people forget that it's actually other people that can't get around as well, that can't move as well, that can't, you know, get up and do what they need to do. They need a little help. AKA, here comes the caregiver. You know what I mean? Now, since, you know, the dawn of time, I don't know what came first, if it was really cavemans that was on the earth, but I know for a fact if it was and they had to go out, they would have had to leave somebody home because everybody couldn't go out and, and, and fight the uh, fight the animals or the prey or whatever they was doing to try to, you know, bring some meals or nourishment back home. Somebody actually had to stick around and uh, take care of the other folk that couldn't make it. So just to let you know how far the caregiver role goes back, like it goes back to like ancient times, you know what I'm saying? And, and if we don't have any good ones, then, you know, it's, it's going to be a hurting feeling. I'm good just dropping in to get some info. Well, that's great. That's great because you definitely in the right place. You know what I mean? I help challenge financial. I help financially challenge family members to become paid caregivers through the Medicaid long-term health care program. So if you know somebody or if you're in a program yourself and you could benefit from an aid, listen, I can send somebody to your house or I can turn your cousin or your brother or your sister or your loved one into the caregiver and they can take care of you. You know what I mean? Now, uh... Me, I like to keep the money in my pocket. You know what I'm saying? Because if I'm the caregiver and I'm already here doing the job, I probably don't need anybody else to come in. I just need to uh, stimulate my income. You know what I mean? Stimulate my economy. You know? So if I can't get the check, then that'll be that'll that'll put me in a whole different perspective. You know what I mean? And that's the general thinking. You know? Because like my mom said, Christmas comes the same time every year. And if you ain't prepared, I don't know what Christmas at your house is going to look like. You know what I mean? So be prepared. Do what you got to do. Let's put the paycheck into your pocket. You're doing a great job. You're taking care of your peoples. You're doing a great job. Let's connect your pocket with the paycheck now. You know what I mean? All right. So if you've got any questions, if you need me, you know, let me know. Okay. Somebody's at the door, so I got to go. So look, I love y'all. You know, don't let anybody shame or blame you into thinking that taking care of your parents and your loved ones is a bad thing because we're doing this to get our blessings, all right? I got to go. I'm going to talk to you soon. Peace.